Say it's probably fine uh, for EG at the end of the day because he doesn't have yeah. to get And look at this. I think he's got his radiance We're on to Anna. Arteezy comes in. He's going to look for involvement on another kill. There'll be an Astral to buy some time for the OD of Fisher coming out. They'll actually get the kill onto Crit. Anna turns oh. around. He pops the Aegis. Anna's going to be able to walk this one off and actually lives through it all. Jerex was able to play with Universe Hard on the back forward. lines of this. RTZ still hanging around, comes back in, but No-Tail pops the illusions out. They play around it, Anna puts No-Tail in the Astral. They the punish RTZ's hunger, and they're not quite done. Samael walking around on negative HP. He's got as well. Easiest triple kill of Anna. Up top, Kaka's moved up here to have some eyes on Universe. Universe, Anna played careful. Now they're trying to have a bit of a go for it. U9 could be bored as well. Just looking for the body blocks, Kaka with some excellent movements here, blocking up Universe. Universe, he can't seem to get himself out of it, falling incredibly low. Four stacks. Is it going to be enough? No, the fifth dead. one it is. Faith will find it. Great play for Newbie and Kaka doing it across the map there. And some fantastic body blocking action from the Bounty Hunter. It was just unfortunate they initiated onto the Illusion, onto the Naga Illusion. You see a little bit of action here in the mid lane. And no turn needs to be a little bit careful. He doesn't have the song. Don't relocate either. Ones. Not gonna chase this one down, I don't think. Well, maybe he is. He's thinking fact, about yeah, it. He is. He's going for this. Oh, oh he's, he's gonna find the chains and well. If he can, I, dead can, eye he, eye. can he get? If he gets no tail as well. Oh, oh no. he's trying. He really wants he it. Really he really wants it. Oh, and he's gonna get it. He got it. Oh, he got it. He gets out. Oh my Lots god. Oh my goodness. Before they made that move over to the left side of the map. And finally, Universal gets some levels. He was level oh, 2. Oh, mid lane. Yeah. Nice That's stop awesome. connection here. They're going to be looking for the crushing blow. Can they get the finish on SC? He's got his level 6, though. He quickly puts the point onto the ball lightning. And he gets a little bit of space. Turns it back and around. Gets the kill on Zai. Heads up play right there from Newbie. Allows him to get the turn around pickup on not just the support, but it looks like they are still going to get a grab on Sumail. Oh, it was all for SC. Can they get him? No! <laughs> he survives. What a dangerous play. Blink and travel between two spots uh, definitely worked out in their favor. Now yeah. coming into high ground, EG, what are they going to do to stop it? I mean, Blast abundance here from Zai, but oh, a big move in. Crush from KP. A follow up combo comes out from SC as he shreds right through him. Quickly taking out Universe from the fight. No roar for you, sir. No buyback will be had. Newbie sweep through the competition now, but here comes the bounce back from EG. Sumail shrugging on in. And suddenly it's going to be U9 on the retreat. Now turn around. There goes the Eclipse. Sumail does not want any piece of it. Arteezy going to be forced to pounce the low ground. SC dishes out the tornado. Will be able to catch on Zai. Turns it back. Lincoln's going to be popped now. Can they get the burst? Stuck in the ice wall there. Gets the right click. That's going to get Zai. Deafening blast. Move on in. Arteezy stuck in that same wall. Will be able to pounce and make it into the high ground, but he's still so slow. Looks like he'll be able to make it out from trouble here, but the onslaught continues as SC gets the next site. Going down and taking out Crit. Now Sumail and Arteezy both look to tag team him, but he's going to be able to get oh out the tornado. He gets the hide. false promise and says, back the hell off. I'm the true 9K here. Bow down before me. RTZ cannot have a say in the matter as SC still continues to go to work. Unai will lose that Aegis and now EG looking to make him pay. A pullback with the X with the pirate combo coming out. The boat is there but SC moves on in. Looks to go for RTZ and still will get the grab. Wicked sick. Turns back Tornado. The universe still finally going to be able to get the roar off but it's in a bad spot outside the base. Will it be enough? It will not. Sumail's here now but ultimately will not be able to help him out with the deeps. Here's the buyback of Arteezy as it looks like this could be the final save for EG. He is just desperate now, refuses to accept that SC Invoker is just doing so much work. SC not allowing it, get the hell off me, bumps him with the deafening blast, blinks in front of him, Kaipi's gonna be there with the crush. Holy hell, I have never and seen. And it is just non-stop, don't even try it, they cannot do a thing about it. I have never seen a single player just make EG look He made them look silly. Dude, they just look like children just like banging on their keyboards at that point. Just, he's like, just stop. Just stop it. Don't, Dude, don't even bother. Godly. I've seen a lot oh. of godly invokers and that I think might have been one of the best ones.